On the coast of Kaohsiung, Xizhuan, recently, people were startled by a black column of water shooting into the sky near a distant freighter amid the sounds of gunfire. All was explained when the military released a video showing the local Marine Corps conducting live fire exercises in a simulation of defending Zhuoying, Taiwan's largest naval base. This comes after the PLA a week ago dispatched a fleet of warships and fighter jets near Taiwan. Experts say Taiwan will need to step up these kinds of exercises more than ever. The distant sounds of gunfire could be heard over the seas off Shijiawan a few days ago. Shortly afterwards, a black column of water could be seen near a freighter. At the time, local residents were puzzled. Now the Navy has released a short video that explains everything. On the coast near Zhuoying on December the 12th, the nation's military was using heavy artillery with full firepower. The Marine Corps and security forces were holding scheduled quarterly exercises involving offensive and defensive warfare for protecting local towns, along with live fire drills. Once the enemy has landed, it can use this place to control Zhuoying's harbour, the main point of entry and exit. Aside from defending Taiwan from an amphibious landing, the Marine Corps has one of the most important tasks of defending our main naval base. The Navy has strengthened its combat readiness and there's a reason for this. The PLA's tactics for Taiwan are continuously changing, from the Liaoning aircraft carriers traversing the Taiwan Strait, to military aircraft skirting Taiwan's main island, to last week when it sent warships to take part in joint drills in waters southeast of Pingdong County. Chinese warships compared with the past are coming closer and closer to our important harbours. When entrances to our ports encounter controlling Chinese blockades and even paralysis, it will be difficult for the Navy to continue with fighting. This highlights the importance of these Marine Corps exercises for defending main harbours. This exercise coincided with China's resumption of military intimidation after the municipal elections. Analysts say the publicity drummed up by the nation's military for these regional routine exercises may be Taiwan's way of saying it can meet China's challenge.